keep independent presidential candidate Robert F. Kennedy on or off the ballot in New York this November could come as soon as tomorrow. Now, that's what Kennedy's lawyers told supporters outside of Albany County Supreme Court earlier today. After closing arguments, a group of voters sued him, saying he lied about living in New York to avoid a residency issue with the California Electoral College. CBS 6's Ashley Kusakaki was in court. She has the story. Go, Bobby! Independent presidential candidate Robert F. Kennedy Jr. was seen leaving the Albany County Courthouse Thursday following closing arguments on a case to keep him off the ballot. I wish Kamala and Bobby could have a debate. I wish they could actually debate their visions for the country and, you know, have that conversation rather than him being stuck in court fighting off, you know, what, what I consider to be lawfare here. Supporters gathered inside during proceedings and outside waving goodbye. Bobby! Bobby! Bobby. I actually got to meet him today, so that was pretty cool. That was very exciting. He walked right over to us in the gallery and uh, shook everybody's hand. Kennedy testified, saying the move to California was temporary. He also spoke with reporters Thursday after closing arguments. No video or audio recordings were allowed. Kennedy said in part, quote, there's over 150,000 New Yorkers signed petitions asking that I be on the ballot in this state. Those Americans want to see me on the ballot. They have a choice. What the DNC is doing in this case is lawfare. You have to put the residents where I vote. This is where I've always voted. I think if they successfully take him off the ballot here, that sets a really, really bad precedent for future elections. Reporting in Albany, Ashley Kuzakonki, CBS 6 News.